Hey everyone, um, I'm here with another tribute to Black History, and today I'll be talking about Jefferson Franklin Long. I believe that Jefferson Franklin Long was a great like pioneer for African Americans as far as being involved in politics and just equality overall. He was the first African American to be a congressman and also the first African American to speak on the floor of the House of Representatives, which I found was really, really informative and interesting. Um, even though he was born into slavery in 1836, he didn't let that stop him from trying to pretty much um, strive for equality and trying to make a difference and trying to inspire people and most of all help people, which is kind of like really hits home. It goes to show that no matter what your struggles are, you don't have to let it like hold, hold you captive to your current position. You don't have to let it limit you from reaching your full potential. And he definitely proved that. He became a prominent member of the Republican Public Party in 1867, and he was also appointed as one of the key leaders and political organizers. Now, although by 1884, uh, most of African Americans have lost most of their power as far as the Republican Party, um, it still paved the way. What he did still paved the way for many African Americans to get involved in politics and have their voice be heard and have their views be shared with other people and just to inspire, enlighten, and educate and just to, like I said before, just fight for equality. So, again, this guy's name is Jefferson Franklin Long. You can look him up. This is just a brief um, understudy about him. But you guys can definitely get the full bio. Um, Google it. And there's actually a good site on um, Facebook called Afrogenesis, and I'll put the name down in the description box below. So you guys can look that up, but they have a lot of informative information pertaining to Black history as well. So you guys feel free to check that out. And I hope you guys enjoyed this um, quick episode of Tribute in Black History, and I'll see you guys tomorrow with another episode. So as always, stay blessed, stay encouraged, and stay educated. Bye.